Welcome back. Well, do you struggle with a sore back or sore neck? Your daily posture could be to blame, with many of us falling into bad habits at work and at home. But the good news is there are easy things you can do to improve your everyday posture and physiotherapist and wellbeing expert Anna Louise Bouvier is here to tell you how. And we've got our resident guinea pig here. Our resident this is Deborah Knight. Fabulous. Fix these scripts, they're appalling! Uh, drama! <laughs> exactly, and this is the thing, you can have the most sensational ergonomic furniture and still slump like anything, which puts all this pressure on your neck. So some of the simple things you can do is Get away from the back of your chair every now so and then. sit on the edge. Sit on the edge and Live balance the edge. there. And when you're sitting, imagine you've got a little light shining out of your chest and it shines towards your screen. So you're shining your light every once in a while, then go back, have a little rest. Then you could have these things. This is a standing desk, so oh, stand yes. up desk. Oh. So just grab it here and it just lifts up, which is I like the standing cool. desk. Yes. That's very good. So instantly you've so got good posture. That's it. But if you can't or you know, like afford this. or you haven't got a, a standing desk, look for things that are around be belly button height. So, you know, mm. cafe benches, top of a three-drawer filing cabinet, all that sort of stuff. Great places to kind of review documents and do things. So stand, you really want it like a piece of exercise equipment. Stand, sit, stand, sit, mix it up. Okay, where do we go now? That's all a right. great idea. Well, the other big thing is that these days everybody seems to spend their lives working in cafes. Mm. <laughs> and so that's exactly right. So we're kind of using our phones and we're using our laptops. The thing is with your laptop, one of the simplest things that I love oh. is a little laptop stand. So you can get a lot of these from, you know, all sorts of different places. They can be cheap or you can get the really great ones that have... But why do you need like a stand? That. What's wrong well, with it? Well, because, again, you're shining your light up into... So your, your eyes aren't coming twisting. down. Oh, yeah. okay. But you need your little portable laptop court keyboard and off you go and then you'll find that immediately you're taking the pressure off your neck. Mm. So if you're kind of working on the move a lot, it's really worth investing in a laptop stand. And what are we doing with our phones that's oh, really okay. detrimental? So slump down. Yeah. This is what you see everywhere and if you imagine like here's your spine, Deb, that is what's happening at I your neck. I can't move because I've got neck pain. That's mm. right. So the thing is just to lift the phone up to your eyes when you're, when you're texting. Really? And so, well, just just so that you hold it here oh, rather look, than you You've got a text, hey mum, Luke's <laughs> coming for dinner tonight. <laughs> well, there you go. There you go. I just <laughs> found out all about it. <laughs> so I'll, this I'll is... Okay, exactly, good. they're fabulous. Good. The thing that... Thanks. <laughs> Teenage kids. Um, so the thing that you realise is you want to bring the phone up to you instead of you down to the right. phone. And okay. what about, what about just ignore that? Just ignore it. What about talking? Hello. Okay, and when you're on the phone, one of the big things is don't... Um, oh. Don't take do that. your head off to the side. Yeah. So, you know, that's probably one of the big things that you see people scrunched up with their head to the side. And crossing of legs too. I know crossing this, of know. legs is really... The minute you cross your legs, it's really hard to time. sit up straight. So, yep. And it's also really bad for your hips. So if you're older and you cross your legs all the time, you have hip bursitis. Disaster. Hip bursitis. Okay. Um, to the so couch. The can couch. Be a guinea pig here. Okay, look, a this pig. is the couch thing. These days, because so many people spend their lives yes. sitting watching kind of Netflix and stuff like that... We're doing it all, we're all multitasking, oh, That's exactly right. I mean, look, much as it's not great to actually be sitting there, one of the things you can do is just put a little pillow mm -hmm. underneath your laptop. In fact, you probably need even a bigger one so that it kind of brings it up. And you need to sit on the edge of the couch, that's too. Should I be putting my feet up like that? Well, no. That, no? Really? I mean, really? I thought that really, would have been preferable. It just turns you into a big banana. Oh, I've mm. been called worse. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so, basically, what you want to do is, if you're going to sit and relax and watch TV and you're using your laptop, which is not ideal... Which I don't do. ..but at least put something up... So that it's up here. So it's up. So that the key is really to try and bring things up to your eyes instead of you coming, coming down. down to the screen. OK. Because we're then kind of... the crazy come, neck. That's it. We're this kind is of, the neck. That's it. It's the banana neck. Mm. And, mm. and this is the biggest thing, like... In physio clinics, you know, we spend our life kind of treating something and then people... It's like the Leaning Tower of Pisa. If it falls over tomorrow, no-one's going to say, well, why did it fall over? Yeah, for sure. It's been leaning for years and yet we kind of keep thinking that, well, I can get rid of this pain, but if you keep doing the same stuff mm. to it, it really creates problems. So it's really a matter of, like, move around when you're in your office. Don't sit, you know, on, um, you know, in a cafe for hours. Sitting's you know, the new smoking, sit, isn't it? That's mm. exactly yeah. it. Mm. You know, when you're at home, 
um, just think about how much you're sitting mm. and, and really try and mix it up mm. and bring things up to your eyes. Mm. Wow, well, you are so good and you're making me stand up straight oh, instantly as I I'm know. talking. You girls have got beautiful posture. Oh, I don't know about that. Oh, well done. Thank yeah. you. Great Thanks, tips. Very handy.